Hi, I'm Shannon Stubbs, your Member of Parliament for Lakeland. My office has received many calls about the Canada Summer Jobs Program because the Prime Minister's announcement sounded like either there was a new program being announced for those that had not applied but were providing an essential service or some new ability to give more approvals under the existing program. Now, he likely did this, assuming that with COVID-19, many organizations that applied would not be able to go ahead with using students in roles they needed, which sounds reasonable on the surface, doesn't it? But he also then, in turn, changed the subsidy from 50% of the provincial minimum wage to a 100% subsidy. So here's the reality. This is not a new program. It's an extension of the existing Canada Summer Jobs Program that closed on February 28th. Here's what you need to know. After his announcements, the MP's offices received a template that they could put forward with a maximum of 25 names. And it did allow for some to apply that had not before. And I know that all sounds great, except that once again, it shows how out of touch the Prime Minister is with Lakeland. Lakeland was not in danger of being undersubscribed because our riding was allocated $877,000 in funding this year, but there was over $1.5 million in eligible applications received prior to the February deadline. So that means that prior to the Prime Minister's announcement, almost as many jobs would already not receive funding as those that would. The second major problem is that no new funding came for the additional names put forward. So any funding that will be received will mean some application that was received prior to the deadline would lose funding. And another pretty major flaw is the subsidy change. Now, I agree that many companies may not have been able to pay even their half portion and allowing it for allowing for it to become 100 percent of the provincial minimum wage is a way for them to keep students employed and save funds for struggling organizations. But simply, if you double the subsidy, unless you double the funding allocation, then less than half the jobs could be approved. That's the reality. So I wanted to reach out as my office staff, Tina and Winita, have been receiving calls nonstop and working with constituents and organizations on this issue. And most times people are asking where the new applications can be found for this program. So I need you to know the truth. The answer is simple. There is no new program and there are no open applications. I hope this explains the Prime Minister's announcement better. Along with my Conservative colleagues, we've called for some additional programs like the creation of a new summer jobs program specifically allocated to agriculture. And we will continue to call on the government to provide concrete measures to support the Canadian economy. I want to thank everyone who's reached out to us and I do encourage you to keep contacting my office at 780-657-7075 or email us at shannon.stubs at parl.gc.ca.